Hi boys and girls, today we're going to learn how to play with Play-Doh. Well, we already know how to play with Play-Doh, but we're going to learn the rules of playing with Play-Doh, okay? All right, Play-Doh fun. Play-Doh was a lot of fun. We have to learn how to play with Play-Doh safely to keep it new so we can play with it all year. Have you played with Play-Doh before? I have. Have you? Do you remember any rules your mom or dad taught you about Play-Doh? Let's read more to find out so we can get to Play-Doh certified. When we play with Play-Doh, we have to first take off the lid. Sometimes this is really tough. Try hard yourself and then ask your teacher if you can't get it. Remember to never use your mouth or teeth to open the Play-Doh. Once we are done playing with the Play-Doh, what might, what, what might we do? Yes, we put the lid back on. It will get hard and icky if we forget. Then we won't be able to play. Oh no, look at this Play-Doh. It looks really gross. Does anyone know what happened? Yes, the Play-Doh colors got mixed together. Do we want to play with this now? No, we like to play with nice and clean Play-Doh. We never want to mix our Play-Doh colors. We will try really hard to keep the colors from mixing together. Give me a thumbs up or we're gonna try really hard not to mix the colors. All right. Play-Doh, we can play many different ways. One of the ways we can play Play-Doh is to make small Play-Doh balls. We get just a pinch of Play-Doh, place it in the middle of our palm, and rub our two hands together. It makes a nice plump Play-Doh ball, like these. Four. When we play with Play-Doh, we can play with Play-Doh toys too. When we play with the toys, we have to be sure to share with our table mates and use toys carefully. What might be some ways we can use the Play-Doh toys in this picture? What, what happens if we want a toy our friend is using right now? We wait our turn or we ask nicely. Play-Doh is a whole lot of fun, but we have to make sure we follow the directions and rules we learned in this book. Are you ready to show me that you are now Play-Doh certified? You know the do's and do nots. Let's play and have fun. Okay, so now that we read Play-Doh Fun, we are going to show you how we use Play-Doh in the class to practice our numbers, our letters, and many other things that we can build with Play-Doh. But I'm going to show you how I'm going to build my name using Play-Doh, okay? So we take off the lid. All right, what do we notice? How many colors do we have here? Just one. What color is this? Green, good job. All right, now I am going to put one little ball in my hand. I'm going to show you how we make a snake so we can make long strips of Play-Doh, okay? Put it down on the table and we move our hand up and down you're going to see how there's a little snake made. I'm going to put that right here. Okay, so now that we have that, we're going to make the other part of the letter L. There goes my spot. Roll it, and done. All right, what letter is that? The letter L, good job. Now I need an I, the letter I. Put it down and roll it. We need a small one, so that's good. Okay, now I'm going to pinch the Play-Doh and only take a little bit. And I'm going to make a little ball, put it in my palm and rub them together. And there we go. Okay. Now the Z needs three snakes. So I'm going to do this three times. Roll it. Good 
Now I'm going to show you how we do it with numbers. So I have the number down. Do you know what number this is? It's the number zero. Okay, so I'm gonna need a really big snake because it's gonna start up here and go all the way around this way, okay? So I have a piece. I'm gonna roll it. Keep rolling so you, you will be able to see that it's going to stretch out if you use two hands. Roll it and move your hand sideways. And we have a big snake now. Okay, now. I said I start at the star and make my way around it. Okay, do you notice how mine isn't perfect? And that's okay because Play-Doh can be a little tricky to make perfect shapes, but that's okay because I know how to write or make a zero. All right, let's try number four. So we need a snake. I'm going to start and make it a little longer. Okay. Start at the star, go to the corner, and back. Okay, now I need one more to go down. Now I'm going to put this here, and we have a number four. And if you don't have these cards at home, it's okay. You can write it on a piece of paper, write the numbers on a piece of paper and do the same thing I'm doing, okay? Okay, now that we're done with that, we put all of our Play-Doh bag in the container, right? Did I mix my colors? What colors do I have in here? Green, okay. Now, we are going to put the lid on and make sure it clicks. Listen, all right. Now that it clicked, we're all done and we can put this back where it belongs. 